The Long Barn was all about this fantastic opportunity of a derelict barn which was effectively waiting for something to happen. The structure was relatively intact and stable, uh, the roofing was, was, in, was in great condition internally and so effectively all we had to do was to slide in this, this tray of this new building and, and modify the external en envelope in, in, in a relatively minor way. The 1860s um, Duke of Bedford model barn was uh, effectively an industrial uh, copy that uh, was repeated all, all over Bedfordshire uh, and was a very, very good platform for, for, for grain storage. It created this very cathedral-like space which meant that we could really enhance that by uh, creating a, a living environment which has these double and triple height spaces as you go through the building and effectively not argue with the fact that it is a long, thin building and it does have this um, fantastic feeling of space. So the building was a, a challenge in terms of we had to excavate uh, half a story down into the, into the ground to be able to get two levels through the building. We had to use very economical and interesting materials in terms of sandblasting um, steel to create this rusty feel to the staircases and some of the detailing, which actually looked like a sort of leather type material. And then we're using very cheap um, plywood and uh, cabinetry to create the, the kitchen and, and some of the door panel systems, but then using some flares of, of interesting lighting systems and triple glazing uh, windows throughout the building that create this overall um, harmonising environment of, of open plan living within this uh, existing barn conversion.